Okay, here we are today. We're zeroing in on this one. You see this one right here with the, with the bronze, goldish bronze kind of wheels? Let me see if I can see it in the picture. Uh -uh. That one right there. Uh, this one is a state bicycle. It's a company that was owned, owned by brothers of the sky that me, that me and my other friend know. We, we know this guy from bicycle rides and hanging out with him and building stuff. Right. Hold on, I'm, gonna make, I'm making this video. Because it's a state bike. Uh, bike. Yeah, check it out, it's camouflage. But anyways, look, this one. This one has got some serious upgrades. See right here? It says right here that it's, uh, it's, it's uh, the Bell State Bicycle Company built it, built the frame and the fork. And this is a carbon fiber fork. This one is a, is a fence, Essex, Sussex, I can't read it because of the sun. Esser, it's an E-S-S-O-R, carbon fiber. Right, it's got a state hub. See, look at that. This is a state bicycle. It's got 1923 C700s. Right, some really nice bronze. We got some really nice bronze color. This one is right. I don't know if I can catch the color of it. Right, and then it's Cami. Hey, it's, what? The guy's stupid because he's got his U lock both around the frame and his chain both to the bars, which is easier to cut. You hear what my friend said? I hope so. But, anyways, look, he's got. He's, he put, didn't have any bosses in the frame, so what he did was he electric taped his cup holder to the frame. He's got some good pedals and cranks. Again, this is Essor. It's got a chain ring. Looks like about a 44, maybe a 46. 48. Yeah, yeah, maybe a 48. Maybe a right, it's, but it's a 20 on the back, looks like to me, because it's 16 is smaller, and he's got yeah. a pixie cog. Look at this. This stuff right here is cool beans right here. Yeah. Track racing, like, evens them all up. Got nine, like I said, look at the bronze on that one. That one looks way better. He's got, you know, tw he's got 16 gauge spokes, which is normal for state wheels. The tires are in good shape, man. This bike gets, you know, look, got a good collar. But, but my friend is right. See, and look, he's got this cable right here too, in yeah. case he needs to hook yeah. something else. But yes, you, you are, you are absolutely right. This is a dumb setup right here. Right, it is. Wait a minute, let me see if I can get in the frame. Uh, right here, right, because here's the U-bolt lock, and then here's, it's not even, look, and it's a combination too. Right there, just cut it right there. You can yeah, see, look, here's. Uh, here's the gear. Uh, nice pedals, yeah. really are. You gotta focus more Pick on that, up. dude. What? The Polishness of this. The Polishness of this. <laughs> yeah, it is. It, yes, it is. It is pretty. Yeah, this is a you know good thief. A good thief knows what we're talking about, and he'll attack this bike. He will. Yeah. Right, see, because bam, just look at this. This is what this is a. Look. This is a sh old Schwinn the tour like mine. Yeah, and look how his is locked up. Yeah, I know. Everybody's got their own style. Look at that one. Uh -huh. What yeah, kind of hey, bike hey. is that? It's an electric, it's a, uh, it's a, uh, Pedego. Pedego, he said. Look at, the, look at the stem on this one. Yeah. Oh, wow, it's adjustable, dude. Yeah. Or is this, what's that thing right there? Look, he left the GPS right there stuck uh -huh. in the thing. I don't think it's GPS, I think it's like a counter. Oh, just, but yeah, you're right. I mean, you just left it there like somebody. See, can that? Yeah, that's hey, like you see. Like somebody you. don't want that. Or this right here for the fucking boat. <laughs> And look, this is an electric hey. bike. Yeah. There's the motor. There's the uh, pump holder. Yeah. I mean, that's a nice this bike. This one is, though. heck yeah, it's just, this is a high dollar bike. Look, it's one of them Shrine Schwins. Right? And, look, and it's again, got the thread list with the collar. It's got a light. Chain lock around it. Uh, even though it's a kryptonite. Yeah, that one's, that even one's. Even though it's a kryptonite, bull cutters will cut right through that. Yeah. That's not, it's not as big as mine, but mine's, just, mine's the same one. This okay. is a cool bike. But anyways, back to the camouflage. Look, straight bicycles. Right, it's a company that Resident and his brother run that's right here in Phoenix. There's like a million different kinds of state bicycles. I think there's, really in reality, I think there's like 48 mm -hmm. different bike styles. And they're all, you know, they start around 400 bucks. Right, look look what you get. This is a cool frame right here. It's all triangles, if you can see it. It's flat and there's a triangle. Right, flat and a triangle. Look, this one here is, this one is, right? This one's pointed and it's round here, right? The chain stays are just round and oval, right? This is a cool frame. I like this one. Reza had a good idea when he designed this one. He really did. Yeah, the bars. Like sports, yeah, look, they're carbon. Oh, right? yeah? Yeah, look at this. It's a C, look, state bicycle file, stem and everything. He's got the right bearing in the back. Look at that. that See? Essa. It's Essa. Yeah. Yeah, this is a carbon. Yeah. Yeah, dude, yeah, upgrade. Serious. So that's a good bike. Anyways, so there it is. You know what I'm saying? Some people know how to. my bolt cutters. <laughs> Some people know how to take care of their shit I and mean, protect it, and other people just ride the crap out of it. Look, see, here, they just ride the crap out of it. 
They don't take care of it. They just think about it. It's a bicycle to them. Right to us. Right to us. Our bicycle is our friend. Our bicycle is our life. <laughs> it's our friend. We need it. But here, look. It's probably, this is probably a $500 special. One of them box oh, specials, Brother Hatch. I don't know, dude. With them forks on it. Look, 